I can't, yeah. remember, for, I can't remember for Bass. Deputy Speaker, with the 20th anniversary of the closing of Coates Patents, I reflect on the changing face of employment in Northern Tasmania. At its peak, Coates Patent was the largest mill of its type in the Southern Hemisphere. Over 2,000 people were employed at its site in the early 1970s. The loss of this icon was felt deeply, not just an economic impact, but also a very real loss of history. The transition from this manufacturing past to a knowledge and skill-based workforce was painful, and the scars still show. Launceston lost its textile mills and it's lost, it, lost its railway workshops and thousands of skilled jobs. But starting in the early 1990s, Launceston took stock and changed focus with redevelopment of the rail yard site and diversification of our economy to tourism, health and education, and new agricultural opportunities, particularly in viticulture and with investment in irrigation. But now we need to prepare our children for jobs that have not yet been imagined. That workforce must be flexible and skilled. It cannot happen without preparation and planning. I'm passionate about the work being done at UTAS, in particular the Australian Maritime College, on energy production and high-end maritime technology research and engineering. The Northern Tasmanian Development Corporation states that the most important investment regional communities can make is in education. That is why the UTAS relocation investment is vital for building the bedrock for our children's educational future and providing secure, full-time, higher-paid employment.